Hi guys, in this video, I'm going to discuss what how to show table structure in Microsoft SQL Server by query. So first, I'm going to write at here or uh, select a statement. Here after we need to use a star, and here after from. So we need to write at here in for Mason schema, and here after press dot. So you get at here constant column privilege so and you're going to use columns now here after let's write where and here going to write to add your table name so add your column table name so add your it's come this name and not now so or table name so we need to give add your table name so going to give at your table name DEPT. So here write DEPT and close by single quote and here. So this is the query to show the table structure in Microsoft SQL Server. So execute that. So at here I'm not getting any or rows. At so at here I'm not getting any rows. So because add here it's a selected master. So here this table inside Adam database. So select the Adam database and execute the query. So see add here it's a displaying table catalog Adam here or table schema DBO table name DPT and here column name. So there are three columns inside DPT. Oh, so select the columns. So here you can find uh, or db number dname log here order position 1 to 3 here default null is null level and here it's a showing data type plot and where cat and here character maximal length so it's the because this is a plot so it's a null and here both are two or oh, packet type so here it's the size 255 and here cat Factor octal and 510, 510, it's the same. So here, numeric precision, it's the 53. And here, radix two, it's all described. So this is the query to find out at here or table structure. So here, call as the name, the escalating, it's the display. Now you can uh, use the different uh, table at this point. So here, so at here going to use EMP table. EMP. Now if you execute here, so see it's the table catalog and here. So different uh, uh, columns you can find. So they are different columns at here. So it's all order position and here is the float and where cap float date times it's the display so this is the way we can display also table structure in microsoft sql server so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you